Hey everyone, this video is about how to do planner tracking using Mocha. Mocha is a dedicated planner tracking application. But here if you have a basic version which comes with After Effects, that will use. So go to After Effects and Presets and type Mocha. And you'll find two Mocha effects, one Mocha E and Mocha Shape. So you have to select Mocha E and apply it in your footage. And this clip I have again downloaded from pixel.com and you can find the link in description. So now we have applied this effects. So you can see here Mocha A is here and you have to click on Mocha logo. And the bottom two I'll explain right now. So let's click on the Mocha logo. It will take you to Mocha basic application where you will do the planner tracking. So here you have lots of tool like the very first one you see here to add the points then this is the pan tool you can move and then we have zoom tool you can zoom in zoom out and third one we have to draw you can draw shapes so i'll take this and i need i want to put my text here so just make few shapes and to this to complete this right click and here we have track motion options scale rotate skew and perspective so click this one also and go to this option surface here we have three options and above there we have track backward forward and stop and then we have link to track which is layer one where we have this video so click on this show surface it will show you how which area it will be like tracking which we can use in after effects when you go back there so i'll just make it like this and here you will be putting our text in after effects so let's track this to track this you can click on this forward tracking and before that you can also on show grid option which will show you how it is tracking and you can have the idea this way and now i can hit forward tracking it is much faster than the three tracking as you might have seen in my previous videos We are almost done. And now we'll be taking this data into After Effects where we can put any clip or any, anything there. So click on this cross button here and then save. So now we have this data. So what we can do in matte, you can save the matte like for rotoscoping, you can use this and tracking data whatever we have used right now we can save and apply on this com ocean ocean com which is just text so go to tracking data option here and click on create track data it will ask you which layer we have just one layer in uh, if you remember in mocha we had just one layer where we created this uh, mass shape so click on this OK and select layer and click OK. So now you can see here five points. One here, 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 and one in center. So if you move, it has tracked. We had already checked there, it is tracked well. So now we need to apply this data to this composition, Ocean Comp 1. So to apply this you can select this export option and layer export too so i'll leave you to corner pin you all have we also have two more options like if you had some motion blur thing we can on and transform so i'll leave you to corner pin and second option we have layer export too here you can select your composition where you want to apply your tracking data so this is our text ocean comp one i'll select this one and now i need to apply so hit apply export and you can see it is sticking there right now to make it more believable i'll apply some displacement filter here so 
select your comp and you can type here displacement so displacement map I will apply on my video oh sorry I'll apply on my comp so now we have applied I'll zoom in a bit just to make sure and here we have displacement map so I'll use this video for displacement of this text so that I can have the animation here so you can select displacement map layer ocean compound right now it's selecting the same composition I'll choose video one so click here and I can see the displacement here and again improve this uh, displacement by horizontal max and vertical so horizontally it will displace more and vertically so I'll make it 7 or 8 for both so now this is displaced so if you make a preview you can see it is displaced now let's scale it slightly so click on this to make it more bigger I can move if you want and I'll also change the opacity from 62% to 50% let's let's play now so this way you can do planner tracking in mocha I hope you find it useful thank you so much for watching